Somebody else dropped some new shit. Oh, Grippy. That's right. Let's do that one first. Where's Grippy? There's no fucking way, right? There's no way this song is as bad as everybody's saying. Yo, ladies and gentlemen, uh, welcome into another video. This is our first time seeing J. Cole come out of hibernation and hiding since he dipped out of the dipped out of the dipped out of the beef really and really the only winner of the beef was j cole he saw what was about to happen it matches his energy that's why i was okay with it after the fact after i saw everything go down with k dot and and drake the way that it started going down and getting real petty and getting real like personal i was like drake's not Drake. J. Cole's personality is too is too like high vibration. It's too up here taking the high road to even like dive deep into this shit. We thought he was being a bitch. I even called him a bitch. I think at one point that's my bad. But really, he knew what the fuck he was doing. I seen everybody clowning this shit on TikTok. I seen everybody clown it on on reels on IG. I just had to I had to hop in. Let's see. I don't even know who this fucking Cash Go Bay motherfucker. He's got four million views. Industry plan. I don't know. Uh, follow us on Twitter. Not Twitter. What the fuck? Follow us on Twitch. <laughs> on Twitch. We're live on Twitch. Uh, we do all of our new song, new Friday album, whatever the fuck you want to call it, live every stream. And then also join us on Patreon. That's where they all go if you don't catch the live stream in action. But other than that, Grippy. Kick game. And when you meet on Kick game, I put a front row to Nick game. Now she in my phone with a nickname. It's, it's, it's mm. Grippy. Yeah. Grippy. Grippy. I call her that cause it's grippy She thinking that if she a hippie And she thinking the lip she gon' lick me And she sending a flip when she hit me With a kissy emoji she miss me When she see me she said she gon' strip me she gon Oh This is not good dog Think about the amount of people That had to okay this shit Somebody listened to this back in the studio Mix and mastered and they were like This shit is fucking gas Yup this is it right here Cole, you fucking slid on this, my boy. You're the GOAT for sure. We're releasing this tomorrow. Somebody said that, and that somebody would have been fucking a liar. This ain't even you, Cole. Leave this to Drake. Leave this subject matter to Drake. This is not you. You don't make good songs about this subject matter. You don't make good songs. <sighs> I think there's as many earnests in my family as there are times that J. Cole's going to let Nas down at this rate are we gonna listen to this whole song we have to right she a hippie and she thick in the lips she gonna lick me and she sending a flip when she hit me with a kissy emoji she missed me when she see me she said she gonna strip me she gonna chew on the stick like it's wrigley's she gonna chew on the stick like it's wrigley's like ripley's she said she was gay until i slay now she's strictly diggly as soon as she pays i'm on the way and i'll be showing her quickly she said she was gay until i slayed and now she's strictly dickly Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Dickly, as soon as she pays, I'm on the way, and I'll be showing her quickly. On the highway, I'm doing 150. Like, I gotta get you up out of the Vickies. Cause it's so good, I just had an epiphany. It's grippy and wet, you know I'm a vet, but you're making me feel like a rookie. How you made me tap out so swiftly, but I'm back for the second round victory. I remember I saw you on Fifth Ave, with your homie Sabrina and Tiffany. I was thinking like, damn, your whole click bad, but I wanted your body specifically. Like, I'm trying to see how that glove gonna fit me. Hmm. I actually hate the melody, too. Like, that is, I don't like that melody at all. Bro. I want to feel like I'm touching your kidneys. Like, bitch, I'm gonna send all your kids. How far does your shit curve to the right, J. Cole, if you're touching the kidneys? That shit is like five inches off the spinal cord. Might need to get that checked. Pay a little extra, make sure they meet Mickey. Do, is J. Cole in some kind of like financial like stress? Is he in like di like dire financial straits right now? Did he need this feature money? Did he place like a 9,000 leg parlay for 100 million thinking he was going to be a trillionaire overnight and then he lost on the fucking second leg of the parlay and now he's doing features for Cash Cobain for $7,500? This shit is dog shit. I mean, he's definitely an industry plant. I have never heard of Cash Cobain until right now. Not that I'm like crazy tapped in with the underground scene, but we, we got J. Cole on this bitch and then Cash Cobain got another track that just dropped this past Friday with a, a whole nother A-list artist. Yeah. Mia, I cannot wait till I see ya. I cannot wait till I eat ya. You got a nigga that I wanna 
And it's not that it's bad, right? It's not that it's bad. I mean, it's bad, <laughs> but uh, but like this is a legitimate subgenre of rap. Like this very, I don't even know, like this melodic shit. I guess you could call call it like melodic rapping to rapping to girls type shit. But this is not J Cole's lane. Like J Cole isn't fluid enough as a rapper to be able to pull this off. Like th this is this should have had a Drake feature a hundred times. Sexy drill. J. Cole didn't have nothing to do with that song after his part at the beginning. Oh, man. What a bad time for features from two of the big three, right? Am I right? Drake's feature was decent. Not going to carry that song in any in any stretch of the imagination. But J. Cole, bro. There's no way that you as J. Cole... You, right here. You, bitch. Talking to you. There's no way that you, like, bowed out of a diss. Everybody was pissed. And then the diss went down. And then everybody's like, oh, J. Cole's the only winner. He's on top. And then your first thought as J. Cole is like, damn, we got to come out with some good shit. Like, the first thing that I do after this diss went down has got to be a banger. It's got to be a banger. There's no way I could risk anything on it not being a banger. And then this is what you put out? You know, I'm not in the mood. J. Cole pissed me off, Elaine. Well, who's where, where's J. Cole's team? Where's J. Cole's people to be like, this isn't the first this isn't the first track we put out after the diss. J. Cole didn't release it. Even agreeing to this shit, knowing that it's going to be released. This this dude probably paid a fucking grippy for a J. Cole fucking verse. He's not going to waste it and not go unreleased. You know what I mean? Pissing me off.